In this tutorial, I'll show you how to create a rigid body motor. Shift D to duplicate, Z to move on the Z axis, and S to scale. Let's add a passive rigid body to the upper mesh, and an active rigid body to the lower mesh. Select the top mesh, and shift select the bottom mesh. Go to Rigid Body Connect. Shift Z to turn on the wireframe mode, and select the constraint object. The bottom mesh's rotate angle will depend on how the constraint object is angled. Let's change the constraint type to motor, select angular, and increase the values like this. If we play the animation, the bottom cube will fall. We need to add another constraint to make it stay with the upper mesh. Before we change that, let's make sure the bottom cube rotates horizontally. That's what we wanted to have. Let's add a new constraint. This time, select the bottom cube first, and shift select the top cube to connect them. Change the type to hinge, and the bottom cube will stay with the top cube while rotating. This is the end of the tutorial. Please like and subscribe, if you have enjoyed watching this tutorial. Thank you for watching.